Welcome, my name is Joseph Cacopino and I'm Nexo R&D Director. Today, I will show you a little bit of what is behind the scene of the ID84 development. Back in the beginning of 2017, we began to scratch our head about a Nexo column with still all the specification to be defined. At the same time, we get a state-of-the-art, competitor investigation, computer simulation, and so on. This was also the time for physical measurements on early prototypes. The concept of an extension emerged, adding modularity, cardioid radiation, and also a nice-looking pole stand, even though the nice look was still a concept at this stage. A simple alignment of the HF drivers was not enough to achieve the targeted directivities. Then, the concept of the spinnaker of HF drivers spin out. Typically, every Nexo product comes with a sub that fits perfectly the application. Here you can see the 2 x 12 inch early prototype. Using these early boxes, the first shootouts were organized. Now that the acoustic part was approved, we added some nice shape to the concept, making it part of the ID family. Aluminum replaced the wood as the main material of the enclosure. The fine tuning also was made, and to match the need of the users, the sub height was increased to 1 meter, offering enough room to add a third 12 inch. On the column type of speaker, the aesthetic is a top priority. With that in mind, every accessory, from base plate to bumper, has been carefully developed by the R&D team. Finally, we are very happy with the result, and we really hope that you will enjoy the ID84 as well. Now, to find out more about ID84 application, here comes François.